Welcome to Selenium Master Test Automation Crash Course Selenium Python Web Driver Lesson 19 Python Web Driver Model View Controller Framework Section Site Functions In this lesson I will explain site functions in the Python Web Driver Model View Controller Framework now let's look at the script. I created a Python file site underscore function dot pi under the folder model underscore view. This file has all reusable functions for the site. In previous lesson, I explained the site model class that has the definition of site elements for the test automation framework. So in this site function, we will be using the elements defined in the site model. So now let's look at the module import. So from Selenium import web driver import time this is for some slip time and from selenium dot webdriver dot support dot ui import select because we will use select to select an item from the sort by group drop down list then from site model import site elements in the site model we define the class site elements so when we use the class site elements in the site underscore function dot pi we will use from site model import site elements format now i create an instance of site elements class so site elements equals site elements web driver we will be using web driver Now I define the class site functions as an object, then initialize the site functions. So def underscore int underscore self, then print reusable functions for the site. So in the test case, we have action login, we have action logout, we have action change user friend control settings then we have sort group name action and we close the browser and quit the browser and also we have log out now let's look at each function so def login function navigate to the Mahara test demo site site elements dot driver because this site elements has the driver so we will be using the existing driver dot maximize window we maximize the browser window and then site elements dot driver dot get navigate to the site then we print site title print site elements dot driver dot title now input username let's change this this is the old code change to admin then input password the password is mahara demo so for this we use the admin so input username admin in the username field site elements then now look at the definition site elements dot get username element dot send the case admin so we define the get 
username element in the site model. So we directly call that method. Now input password Mahara demo in the password field site elements dot get underscore user underscore password underscore element dot send the keys Mahara demo. Then click on the submit button. So site elements dot get underscore login underscore button underscore element dot click. And then we will check if logout link is displayed. So is logout visible? Then site elements dot get logout link is displayed. Then print check status. That means if the logout link is displayed. So print logout link display is logout visible. Then return login status. So return is logout visible. So this will be for the login action. Now for the logout action, click logout link. So site elements start get underscore logout underscore link dot click. We click on the logout link. Check if username text field is displayed after logout. So is login visible equals site elements dot get underscore user underscore name underscore element that is displayed. Now we print display status. So print login username field display is login visible. Then return is login visible. So this is to find out if the login button is displayed after user logout. Uh, actually here we check for the login username field. So now we check friend control in the user setting settings page. So on the user settings page, we will click on nobody may add me as friend element. This is a radio button. We need to click on that. So we define change underscore user underscore friend underscore control underscore settings. Then click on the settings link site element dot get underscore setting underscore link underscore element dot click. We click on the setting link. Then we click on the nobody may add me as a friend really button. So site element dot get nobody may add me as friend element dot click. Then I added five seconds for uh, slip time for demo purpose. Then site element dot get save settings button element dot click. We click on the save button. Then wait about 10 seconds site element dot driver dot implicit wait 10. For this implicitly wait statement, actually you can define a dynamic wait until the preference save it message is played. Now we get confirmation message. Confirmation text equals site elements dot get preference save it message dot text. Then return confirmation text. So this will be for the change user friend control settings test. Now the third test is we can sort by group name and get the most recently joined. So sort group name by most recently joined function. Def sort underscore group underscore name. Then click on this settings link. Site elements dot get underscore setting underscore link underscore element dot click. We click on the user setting link again. Then 
we need to use the select from the package selenium dot webdriver dot support dot ui import select we need to use this select so we select site elements dot get group name sort by drop down element dot select by visible text from this drop down list we select by visible text visible text is most recently joined now time dot slip then site elements dot get underscore save underscore setting underscore button underscore element dot click we click on this saving button now then wait about 10 seconds site elements dot driver dot implicitly wait then get confirmation page confirmation message equals site elements dot get preference save it mess dot text then return confirmation message now we close the browser close browser function def close browser site elements dot driver dot close then quit browser function def quit underscore browser self site elements dot driver dot quit so on this site functions we defined all reusable actions